This will be easy. This jade would put any emerald to shame. Stand aside. I will see Katana. No one enters the tower. You are an excellent guard dog, Baraka. But you must learn to heal. Welcome to Next of Ken. Today we're taking a look inside the Mortal Kombat journey of the Adenian General herself, Jade. Like Katana, Jade's origins trace back to Adenia, a realm conquered many ages ago by the Emperor Shao Kahn. When Kahn took Sindel and Katana as his wife and daughter, he also kidnapped Jade, Katana's childhood friend, and trained her to be a proficient and formidable assassin under his command. Jade first appeared during Mortal Kombat 2, spying on the events as they unfold and only battling players were necessary on behalf of Shao Kahn. During the events of Mortal Kombat Trilogy, her friend Katana fled to Earthrealm after being sentenced to death for treason. Shao Kahn then appointed Jade and Reptile the task of finding Katana and bringing her back to Outworld. While he assured Jade that he wanted Katana brought back alive, he in fact told Reptile to bring her back by any means necessary, including death. Torn by loyalty to both Katana and Shao Kahn, Jade ended up siding with their friend instead, and thwarted Reptile's assassination attempt. Jade and Katana joined Raiden in the battle against Shao Kahn, and ultimately they freed Sindel from the Emperor's control and freed their homeworld of Edenia from Outworld. Afterwards, Sindel appointed Jade as general of the Adenian armies until Mortal Kombat Deception where Jade was forced to return to the arena. After witnessing Onaga's rise to power and his subsequent enslavement of her recently departed friend Gitana, Jade traveled to Adenia to alert Sindel of her findings, only to discover that Adenia was besieged by a disguised Molina and Sindel was being held prisoner with the resurrected Gitana serving as her guard. Jade battled her friend, rescued Sindel, and together they fled to Outworld to assist in defeating Onaga, and to seek retribution against Tanya, who allowed Edenia to be invaded once again. During the events of Mortal Kombat Armageddon, Jade fought in the apocalyptic final battle against Tanya, but like the others, was ultimately bested and killed during the fight. Who is she? Jade. This is Sonya Blade. Major Jackson Briggs, you've got an incredible set of legs for kicking at me. In the 2011 reboot of Mortal Kombat, Jade's story was slightly retconned. The story depicted her having been present during the first tournament as an active participant. Following Shang's defeat and Khan's announcement of a secondary tournament in Outworld, Jade noted Khan's displeasure with Katana's behavior and sought to warn her of it. Despite Katana's unwillingness to listen, Jade continued to follow her and tried to prevent Katana from going to Shang Tsung's flesh pits due to vague orders given to her by Shao Kahn. Unable to convince her friend, Jade was forced to battle Gitana, but lost the fight. After it was revealed that Shao Kahn ordered the creation of Molina in an effort to replace the princess, Khan ordered Gitana's immediate incarceration. Realizing that her loyalty to Shao Kahn had put her best friend in jeopardy, Jade set out to make amends and free Gitana from captivity. Jade turned against Khan and enlisted Raiden's help. Together they defeated the Emperor and saved Gitana from execution. Following this, Jade joined the forces of light during the invasion of Earthrealm and helped fend off an ambush from the Lin Kuei. But when Sindel arrived and began her assault of the church, Jade was one of the many warriors killed by the empowered queen as Sindel ripped the stomach out of her body, killing Jade instantly. Following this, when Raiden saw Quan Chi's aid, the sorcerer revealed to Raiden that Jade, along with the other deceased warriors, were now resurrected as revenants under his control. Quan ordered Jade, Smoke, and Sub-Zero to attack the Thunder God, but Raiden escaped before any battle could take place, leaving Jade trapped in the Nether Realm along with her other companions. Despite being under the control of Quan Chi, Jade is the only revenant that didn't make an appearance in Mortal Kombat X, leaving Jade's true fate completely unknown. What happened to Jade after Mortal Kombat 9? Does it have something to do with the mysterious woman in her MK9 ending? We shall see. 
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and leave a comment about who should get the Combat Origins treatment next. Stay tuned. Jade wins.